Hello and welcome back to my channel. My name is Marie and I use Adobe Illustrator to create my graphics. Today we're going to create this fun vector for t-shirt prints. So let's start by selecting the ellipse tool. Click on the artboard and hold shift to draw a circle. Then we're going to change the fill color to yellow. Darker yellow. And I'm going to leave the stroke to black but change the stroke width to 3. So now we have this little yellow circle that is the base for our smiley face. Now use the ellipse tool again, only this time with fill, black, no stroke, to create an ellipse inside of our circle. And this is going to be our smiley face eye, the first eye. Now select the ellipse, drag it over while holding alt to create a copy. So now we have our smiley face, the eyes, we're missing the mouth. So select the ellipse tool again, and go to the center of the circle that we already have, and while holding Alt and Shift, design a circle from the center which is smaller than the first circle. Now select the scissor tool, and click on the right and left anchor point to make cuts, and then with the direct selection tool, select the top part of the circle, and click delete. Now we have just the bottom part of the circle, but we need to make sure that we leave the stroke to black and change the fill to none. Then go to the stroke panel, go to the arrowheads section, and we can add an arrowhead to our line. In this case, I'm going to add this black dot. Here where it says scale, you can scale it down. Let's try 20% is too small. Let's put 40%. That looks good. So now I'm going to select the line again and add an arrowhead to the other side as well. The same one with the same uh, percentage. Now our first part of the tutorial is finished because we have our smiley face. The only thing that I'm going to do to uh, finish this first part is expand our strokes. So select everything, go to object group, and then here align to artboard, align to center, vertically and horizontally. So now our smiley face is at the center of the artboard. Now I'm going to double click on the smiley face to enter the group. I'm going to select the two eyes, go to Pathfinder, Unite. So now the two eyes are part of one shape. I'm just going to make sure they're still aligned. And then go to Object, Expand. Now we still have our strokes, so I have to go to Expand again, because the first time it just expanded the arrowheads. And then Expand on the bottom circle as well. Okay, so now we have no more strokes, we only have shapes. Double click anywhere on the artboard to exit the group, then select your smiley face, drag while holding alt to make a copy, and holding shift to keep the copy aligned. Then click on control D to repeat your last um, action, which would be the copy. Now select all three smiley faces. We're going to move them back onto the artboard because they went off. And again, we're going to make an aligned drag copy. So select all three. Go drag upwards while holding Alt to copy and Shift to keep the copy aligned. And then again, Control D to repeat your last action. Now select all nine smiley faces. Bring them back onto the artboard. I'm going to object group and then again go to the align panel and align to center vertically and horizontally. Now comes the fun part. So while they're select the group is selected, go to object, envelope distort, make with uh, warp. And where it says style, click your style, which mine is going to be twist. You can change the amount of uh, twist with the bend uh, section, and then you can make a distortion horizontal or vertical. 
In my case, I'm not going to add a distortion because I want my final result to be um, in a square shape. So I'm going to put these two to zero. And I'm going to change the bend to 84, which is pretty high. Okay, when you're done, please press OK. And we're almost done. The only thing I want to change is that smiley face in the center. I want it to be straight. So I'm going to select my smiley faces and go to Object Expand. Now I'm going to double click and then double click again on the center face here. And then I'm going to turn it. So it's straight. Click on the art, double click on the artboard to exit the group. And here is our vector smiley face twist effect. You can download this vector and many more off of my Shutterstock. I'll leave the link below. I hope you enjoyed this tutorial. Please subscribe and don't miss out any of my future videos. Ciao!